Hello, it's Anne here from Domesticity. Just in the car outside the um, mall, just about to jump in and do my grocery shopping for the fortnight. So remembering I've got $150 budget um, to spend and I'm back into my normal routine of uh, doing a bigger shop um, in the first week and the second week um, is just a bit of a, a top-up shop uh, for fruit, veggies, milk, bread, that sort of thing. But the budget for the whole two weeks is $150. I've got my list and I'm ready to go. So come back soon and I'll show you what I bought. I'm back from the grocery store with my haul and I'll just go through what I got and how much it cost. I've got a kilo of brown onions, a couple of tomatoes just for burgers or sandwiches, um, some baby cos lettuce, plain flour, some tartare sauce, special burger sauce, bananas, broccoli, red capsicum, these were all on special, a uh, piece of pumpkin, some pears, um, long life lemon juice, some dried apricots and dried pineapple pieces. My kids have gone off fruit so um, my son likes dried fruit so thinking of making like a trail mix for him for school lunches with some dried fruit in instead. Some tissues, olive oil, tomato paste, gravy mix, chocolate chips both white and uh, milk chocolate just to stock up the baking supply now that it's getting cooler and to do some baking. Some dried oregano, spreadable butter for sandwiches, um, two lots of butter for baking, some pasta spirals, um, spaghetti pasta, a dozen eggs, grated cheese, coconut cream, paper towel, a tin of tuna, a kilo of great uh, Australian cheddar cheese, some feta cheese, tortillas, a small tub of Greek yogurt. I used to buy it in the kilo tub, but we've sort of changed the way that we eat, the way I use yogurt in my cooking. So I find I don't need a kilo, just um, 500 mils does us now. Some crushed garlic and pitted calamari olives. Some green mixed vegetables, which I always keep in the freezer. I was lucky to pick up a few marked down baked items. Um, the kids like these croissants and pastries for breakfast. So some chocolate pastries. Some crinkle cut frozen chips for the freezer. One loaf of bread because I've still got a bit of um, bread. Some frozen fish. And I noticed that's gone up um, in price by a dollar. So... Um, that's still not too bad. Um, some some salmon fillets. I was lucky to get a few markdowns in the meat department. Um, not big savings, but still a, a slight reduction. Some um, hoisin marinated uh, chicken breasts, lamb mince, and two lots of um, chicken breasts. So I thought I was going to be cutting it fine on my $150 budget. And I did. It all came to $145.19, which leaves me just short of $5 for um, my second week if we run out of milk or anything. So um, we've got a fair bit of milk left in the um, in the fridge. So we'll see if we can make that last. Otherwise, if we go over, we go over. But um, this is still quite a good haul for $145, which will no doubt last me more than a fortnight um, with all that meat and eggs and pasta and everything else that I needed. So um, that was my haul for today. Thank you.